Hello guys and welcome to a showdown in your life featuring Specs Hypo Beam Weezing because Glalon Weezing is the best Glalon form revealed so far. So let's get started. So we got our first match against I can't say his name and I don't think anyone can. Here's an Aerodactyl, a Chinchino, Steelit, Hitmon Top, um, Vaporeon, and Mesprit. I think leading off with Incineroar, getting my Intimidate drop will be important if he leads with Steelix or Aerodactyl. Yeah, he's getting his rocks up just as I expected. Um, I'm gonna go out to Zatu. I'm kind of regretting not putting Heat Wave on Zatu. Maybe this skills Steelix out. I don't think it would. It did, um, but I think I just outplayed him even more. Um, he can go. Oh, he sucker punched me! Um, also, my team is like garbage. I made this myself again, so I think going out to Weezing is actually a decent um, bet. I can go for Hyper Beam. I'm blaming that for a Pokemon that I can't touch, like literally can't touch. He can actually go out into this. I'm gonna stay in and just Flamethrow. I think Specs Flamethrower will do a decent amount. Yeah. If you switch out to steal it, I do a decent amount. Um, that didn't kill. I'm modest, right? I, I am modest, right? Yeah? Yeah, I'm modest. Okay. Vaporeon. Okay. I got a bot. Dude, I'm the luckiest person ever created. Uh, we can go to Zatu, I guess. Oh, I don't have a good water. Oh, I didn't play a water resist on my team. That's amazing. Uh, <laughs> my water resist is uh, in Cinderwall, I guess. I guess that works. It's not like I have two Pokemon weak to water. Hmm. Okay. We might have to lose right now. Or not lose, like lose. I don't mean lose completely, I mean lose Zatu. I'm over Psychic. Also, I'm going to redo my team a little bit. I'm going to put um, Decidueye. I just want to use Decidueye, I guess. <laughs> let, let me put uh, a good Pokemon on my team. Uh, Longridge. I mean, Longridge does seem pretty good. I'm going to use it. Leaf Blade. Uh, I don't know what they run. Defog Roost. I know they get Defog and Roost. Um, I guess I can run the ghost move that it gets which spirit shackle there we go and just special defense yeah that can replace something I don't know I don't know what it can do but is that validated yep uh, I'm sorry for that I just didn't realize I didn't have a water resist um, I got to wheezing and go for the Thunderbolt um, I don't know if he's gonna realize I'm specs wheezing if he does realize I'm Specs Weezing, he... Oh, dude, that's an IQ play. And we killed us at the Aerodactyl. Specs Weezing already put in the walk. A water resist? What's that? He can go out to Stilts and see if I'm Specs. But I don't know if he knows I'm, like, in remote. I don't know if he remotely knows I'm Specs. If he does, he can just go out to Stilts. He can taunt me right now and go out to Vaporeon and then switch into still it's just make me waste another Thunderbolt PP, but only bad players do that. By bad players, I don't mean people that are actually bad at Pokemon, I mean people that are actually bad people. But yeah, let's see what he goes for. Okay, so Specs Weezing made him press X on the tab, which is just amazing. So we won our first match. Um, let's get into the second match. Okay, so we're in the second match right now. He has a Vaporeon, a Sneasel, a Hitmonlee, uh... Helolisk, Helolisk, don't know, a Fail Seed, and a Shishino. Um, I actually do think leading off with Cinnabar again is my best bet. Um, he can lead off with like four of his Pokemon, and I can do stuff against it. Even if it's just get an Intimidate drop for a Shishino. Um, Vaporeon and Helolisk go me out, but I have answers for those. Um, for this Pokemon, Helolisk, I do have Rhydon. And for Vaporeon, I have uh, my Decidueye added to the team, so... I don't know. Uh, Master of Honor. He's obviously not going to disrespect us. Okay, so he led off with Vaporeon. Vaporeon's a good Pokemon to lead off with. I do have my Decidueye, so I'm just going to switch out to that. Uh, actually, I'm just going to set timer. I don't really want these to take that long. I mean, I don't care how long it goes. Uh, well, that's not good. Uh, I have this out on the field, which means he's definitely going out into Fear Seed. Fail seed? Why did I even think he was going out to fail seed with Decidueye? I'm going for Thunderbolt right now. 
I... Hmm... I'm questioning myself. Fearless is definitely the play you go out to. I think that's the case. Okay, he just flamed. I'm pressing flames all again. No, I'm not. I'm going back out to Decidui. Uh, go out to Decidui. Leaf Blade him. Yeah, he just scards. Maybe, does he know I'm Specs? If he knows I'm Specs, then um, I'm in trouble already. Because that's the only way I can kill um, the Fail Seed. It's an option I can stay in on. He thought I was going to switch out. That's amazing. Uh, I'm going to Spell Shackle him. If, I'm sp if I Spell Shackle him, he can't switch out and he'd be locked. Oh, wow. He just protects. Uh, I'm going out to Incineroar right now. Um, Incineroar is definitely the wrong play. I'm going back out Weezing. Oh, I don't really know. I can't kill this. Actually, I can't kill this. I'm going out to Reveal. Yeah, Reveal on, Sleep Paddle, and Spam Hawking. That's how I kill this. Um, I don't think Decidueye is the best Pokemon for this. I could actually put um, Delmines on the team, and I think Delmines would do so much more work. Okay, he goes out to Heliolisk. Hilo yep, English is my first language. But he's obviously going to be Fort Switch right now. Um, he can go for Surf. If he goes for Surf, he's a god, and I deserve to lose. Okay, I deserve to lose, but I can go out into Weezing. I go out to this, and I go for the knockoff. Um, if I can knock off the Phil Seed's um, Veilite, I can do more damage against it with Veilion, like this. Um, if we went out to Vaporeon, I got rid of his leftovers. Totally useful. Um, i just going to go out to Incineroar and press moves. He got rocks up. Uh, that's not really good for me. Actually, I'm just going for Thunder Punch. He can protect. He might think his um, Fearless is not worth it, though. Okay, no, he just goes activate Vaporeon. Uh, that's super effective. Uh, I'm going for the knockoff right here. Get rid of his leftovers. Uh, if he wishes right now, that's his best play. He does not wish. Ooh, that's a mistake and a half, dude. I'm breaking through your Vaporeon. I don't kill. You can do so much damage to my Incineroar, but that really doesn't do anything. Yeah, my Incineroar would be weakened, and I do kind of want Incineroar for stuff. Also, why, why is my Incineroar super slow? I'm going to put a little bit more speed on it. Like, get rid of some HP and just put some speed on it. I don't know if that does anything. That probably doesn't do anything. We probably have, like, 65, actually. Uh, yeah, Thunder Punch it. He can wish out into something. Uh, I'm really hoping he wishes out to Hilloesque and just tries to go for Solve so I can get another kill. Um, especially since I lost my ride on. He goes out to Fearless Seed. I'm just gonna spam Flow Blitz. You don't really skill me out or anything. Yeah. And uh, I'm now I'm really hoping he goes out to um, Hilloesque and just thinks he can do stuff against me. That'd be hilarious. Because I do think I live a, um, a non spec soft right now. He goes to Shishino, that's the correct play. I'm gonna. I, I know he's obviously going for um, Rock Blast still, so I really can't do anything about that. But I do. Yeah, I don't know why I tried to fake out. I was like, why did I fake out? Um, I speed tie? I thought this Shishino was slow. DT Apion. I'm actually checking this out. DT Shin. I thought Chinchino was um, base 110. 110? 110. Uh, I can just go for the fake out here. Um, he really has no answers for this. Like so. Uh, going out to Decidui on rocks is probably my worst play right now, but. I really don't want these rocks up. Like, I really, really don't want these rocks up. Which means I'm just gonna stay in this speed try. Oh, he u Oh, he u turned though. That means I get a strong double hit on something. Also, I did calc double hit over return, and double hit does do more damage by like 3%. So, I did run double hit. Um, I can miss double hit, so that's kind of scary, and I know I shouldn't be using it, but I was like, I'm using Technician um, A Palm. I should definitely use double hit. What is he u turned? He goes out to Sneasel. I don't agree with the play. Yeah, you just lost your Sneasel. Yeah, I don't agree with that play. 
Uh, you got to do this. I'm going to have to decidue. I faster than uh, I can click a move. It's especially since I can get the defog off. And since I can get the defog off, um, he can't get rocks back off and rocks back up because he got rid of his fill seed pretty early. I don't know why he did that. Did he think I was going to predict him to switch? He lost his water resist. He, oh, he goes off. I thought I would love that. Can I actually just run like a mid set on this? I don't really need a special defensive set. Like maybe more of a mid set. There we go. Changing my team live. I don't like doing that, but. Uh, I guess we got to this and we could just press fake out and fake him out and then go for knockoff. Oh. What's this? What's this you're doing? I have no idea what he's doing. If he goes out to Hitmonlee, I'm actually just going to... He goes out to Healisk. I don't know what he's doing. I'm gonna select Pavilion right now. I don't think Pavilion do anything, does anything. One... Did I put EVs on you? Why did I make it modest? I just first. This is why I always set my own EVs and everything. Uh, Vivon, just come out. Um, die to the Volt Switch. He's gonna go back out into his Hitmonlee, and I think I win now. I literally do think I win. I just go out to Apom. Um, Ambipom, not Apom. Um, I just click Fake Out again. Uh, Fake Out will prevent him from getting his, um, Indoor off, I believe. I believe that's how that works. I think fake out goes after, um, before, no, after indoor, and indoor goes before fake out. It's like priority six versus five. He actually just goes out into this. Is this scarf? If that's the case, I lose. Okay, I didn't think anyone ran scarf um, healers. I was predicting it would actually be more um, specs. I'm just going to knock off. Do I just go for double hit? He really can't do anything. I'm going for a uh, knockoff. Just knock off whatever item he has. He has a lychee berry. Okay. Whoop, GG. He can go for double indoor. Try to get the, um... I don't actually know. Oh, wait. Well, I guess he doesn't get to his plus one. I guess that's the best part. Do I go for that hyper beam? Actually, I need to cap this. I'm pressing hyper beam. You only live once. And I miss Hyper Beam. We're not clicking Hyper Beam again. We're not clicking Hyper Beam again. <laughs> I was like, you only live once. If I lose this because of stupid stuff right now, I I'm gonna be mad. I can't be that mad, but I'm gonna be mad. Let's go for Knock Off. Knock Off will do less damage now, but he might not know that. Uh, clicking Hyper Beam though was obviously a stupid play, but I clicked Hyper Beam and of course I missed the 90% move. But Weezing is, Specs Weezing is fine. Uh, oh, he misses high jump kick. Uh, yeah, GG. You dissolve that. You dissolve that after you evaded my hyper jump. Hyper jump? Hyper beam. But let's find the third match. Okay, so we found the third opponent we have. He has a Metacham, a Sneasel, a Blastoise, a Weezing too. Wow, nice choice. Uh, I don't know what that Pokemon is. Actually, I do know what this is. I just don't remember its name. Togi de Uh, and Dredigon. I do know what that Pokemon is, though. I was actually going to use that on over um, Incineroar or Viveron. And I was like, I need a special tackle or a defensive special wall. I don't know which one I did, but I did have it. Um, he might lead off with his Togi de Maru. Uh, if that's the case, I can lead off with Incineroar. Um, if he leads off with, yeah. I'm just going for um, knock off and just knocking off something. Um, if that, I think that Dredagon, yeah, the Dredagon is obviously going to come in. I mean, why wouldn't it? Um, I'm going to get hot. I didn't get hot. He has a Z move. He doesn't have rough skin and he has a Z move. That's scary. Uh, I'm going out. I really want to go to Decidueye, but I don't want to lose Decidueye. I'm going out to Rhydon. Uh, I don't want. I'm gonna press Toxic and see what I can do. Um, he can definitely switch out. Oh, he glowed me. That means I'm going to get fully paralyzed. He's gonna Z Draco me. Yeah. 
Oh, Z Drake me, whatever. Z Dragon me. Z Dragon Claw, probably, actually. Um, I'm just gonna get my rocks up. Even though I'm actually planning on getting rid of them as soon as possible. Um, do I want to keep this healthy? It does. It doesn't really do anything now. Uh, he got outrage that doesn't do anything. Um, I was actually like thinking maybe keeping it healthy, but he has a Medicham, a Sneasel, a Blastoise, a Togedemaru. I don't think I'm gonna do anything versus those mods, and I can't do anything and get wheezing. Like the other mods that speed me and pretty much kill me, and his physical tackles. I'm just gonna go for Toxic. He went for Rapid Spin. Okay, that's fine. I'm used to it. Just go for your scar to kill me. Uh. Ah. Why? Just go for the fog. Is my wheezing an answer to your wheezing? Hmm. I wonder. Do I got two wheezing? He went for Will O Wisp. I'm going for my hyper beam. Just hyper boom. Kill him. We have to recharge. The hyper beam wheezing has done something. That this is too upset, of course. Uh, I do live. I just don't know if I want to risk this. Obviously, I want to risk this. Um, I think getting a sleep powder off is. Please don't flinch me. I've missed so much. Thank you. Let me get one crow up and see what happens. You guys have to sneeze off. Um, obviously, I should keep this alive. I'm going out to this. This is obviously the wrong play. I should have went out to like another Pokemon and sacked it. Uh, he might go out to Weezing. He's definitely going out to. I'm just gonna knock off here. Yeah, he lost his. Oh, he lost his choice scarf. I'm gonna first knock off again. I'm interested in what he goes out to. Um, if he goes out to Blastoise, I can knock off it and get rid of an item. If he goes out to Medicham, which is the best play. Um, I don't do anything. Um, I need to get the fog off though. I'll see. Actually, I'll see. Yeah. Um, actually, I got the Decidueye. Decidueye is definitely my play. The Decidueye definitely was my play. Um, it keeps Incineroar um around so I can have an Intimidate user. Also, yeah, I'm still like. E I feel like I'm just getting hatched today for no absolute reason. I had like just a good like couple of rounds and it's like I had like the first half of this episode just really good like winning no hats on either sides and then I get into a match and I get into my second match it's like oh no hats thank you and then it's like oh wait a minute I think I am getting hats and then I just go for fake out fake out right here just goes up to this I don't I think I can. This is going to do a decent amount of damage to me, but I have to do it. One. Ooh, it hurts. It hurts me so much. And I'm st I'm at least just regular poison and not toxic poison. So it doesn't get um, a higher damage off on me when it each turn. There we go. I think I do have a good chance of winning this. I actually do think, um, okay. I have a good chance of winning this if he sacks his Sneasel to. I'm going for knockoff right now. Um, I think knockoff is maybe not the play. I think maybe pressing Flow Blitz is the play, but I'm putting him going to Medicham, which is not healthy, or Blastoise. He's obviously going to Blastoise, so. Uh, I did do. Actually, I did so much damage, I might kill it with a Thunder Punch. Or weaken it severely. Or I don't outspeed. Why do I not outspeed these Pokemon? Uh huh. I got to this and I can press Hyper Beam, I guess. I can't press Hyper Beam actually. I have to press um, Sludge Bomb and just hope I kill, which I don't get the poison. So I literally have to go out to um, Ambipom. You know what? I'm risking it, by the way. I'm going out to Vivion. I'm going to have to let Vivion die after this. Okay, thank you, I didn't miss the Pokemon. I actually don't know Hurricane's accuracy. He goes as Sneasel, Ice Shard me. 
Uh, the thing I have to rely on is an A-Palm crit. Uh, yeah, I could have missed that. Uh, this might end up not as well as I think uh, as it should. I have to get a fake out crit right now. Fake out crit, that's all I'm asking for. I've been getting hatched all game. And it might have cost me the game. A couple of those hatches. I'm not, I'm not saying that I'm bad. Okay, a crit fake out would have saved me, by the way. It definitely would have saved me. Oh no, he has bullet punch. Ah, GG. Uh, should I end it here? I should end it here. I don't think I'm going to get another match that's really good. So we had three matches. That's how much I want to keep it up to for episode. So if you guys enjoyed this episode of the NU Showdown Live, press the like button. But if you hate these, press the dislike button. If you made it to the end of this, you can subscribe because you obviously like my content enough to subscribe. I'll be doing these showdown videos every so often. I don't know when. Definitely on the weekends. But thank you for watching. And goodbye.